The Earth will eventually destroy itself, just like any other star or planet, however. The exact timing and mechanism of destruction are still uncertain. One possibility is that the Sun will eventually expand into a red giant star. When this happens, it will engulf Mercury and Venus, and possibly Earth as well. However, this is not likely to happen for billions of years. Another possibility is that the Earth will be destroyed by a massive asteroid impact. Asteroids are constantly orbiting the Sun, and some of them are large enough to cause catastrophic damage to Earth. In fact, there is evidence that a massive asteroid impact caused the extinction of the dinosaurs. 66 million years ago, another possibility is that the Earth will be destroyed by a gamma ray burst. Gamma ray bursts are extremely powerful explosions that occur at the end of the lives of massive stars. If a gamma ray burst were to occur near Earth, it would bathe the planet in radiation, killing all life. Finally, the Earth could also be destroyed by its own internal processes. For example, the Earth's core is slowly cooling and eventually it will solidify. When this happens, the Earth's magnetic field will disappear and the solar wind will strip away the Earth's atmosphere. Without an atmosphere, the Earth would become a barren rock. Here are some more specific scenarios for how the Earth could be destroyed. Supervolcanic eruption. A supervolcanic eruption is a volcanic eruption that is much larger than any eruption that has occurred in recorded history. A supervolcanic eruption could release enough ash and sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere to cool the Earth's climate and cause a global extinction event. Snowball Earth. A snowball Earth is a hypothetical scenario in which the entire Earth is covered in ice. A snowball Earth could be caused by a combination of factors such as a decrease in solar output or a massive volcanic eruption that releases sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere. Heat death of the universe. The heat death of the universe is a hypothetical scenario in which the universe reaches a state of equilibrium in which there is no free energy available to do work. This would mean that all stars would eventually burn out and all planets would become cold and lifeless. It is impossible to say for sure how or when the Earth will be destroyed. However, it is important to be aware of the potential threats to our planet, so that we can take steps to mitigate them. In addition to the natural threats mentioned above, humans could also contribute to the destruction of the Earth. For example, if we continue to pollute the environment and deplete natural resources, we could make the Earth less habitable and increase the risk of extinction events. It is important to remember that the Earth is a precious and fragile planet. We need to take care of it and protect it for future generations.